Hi folks, we're at LR Workshop. Uh, I've been asked about uh, gearbox oil coolers because I've mentioned them in some of my videos before. So here we have the difference between on the left, the adapter for the LT77 and on the right, the adapter for the R380. So I'm just going to line them up here and show you they are pretty much identical. Dimensionally, they, they even look like they came out of the same mold. Drill holes are in the same place. They've got the same circlip arrangement, which I believe is holding in the thermostat. Rear face is the same. They've even got the same KE marking there on the out in between the outlet ports. So essentially what I'm saying is one adapter will fit onto. So you could take an LT77 adapter and fit it onto an R380, no problem. The bit where they're different is with the pipes. So really you need to match the pipe work to the adapter, not the pipe work to the gearbox. I'm going to unscrew these and show you why right now. I've kept these, I just, these are from some old rubbishy pipes, so I've just kept them. Uh, just so that at a later date I can measure them up and give you some dimensions. There we go. So on the right we have the R380 version and on the left we have the LT77 which uses a conical uh, tapered fitting and on the right we've got a crush fitting that has an o-ring. There's supposed to be an o-ring on there. Uh, diameter wise they're about the same just the right hand pipe had a bit of a kink in it. But you can see in the adapters themselves you can see the different fittings, how they fit in, and how they seal up against the end of the pipes. So really, you could, you could get your own pipes fitted up to this uh, if you had the correct adapters, no problem. There are different pipe variations uh, that were fitted to Range Rovers or to Wolves or to standard TDI, uh, TD5 Defenders that were in hotter climates. Link above to uh, go and see some of those on LR Workshop. Anyway, hope that cleared up a few questions that some people have about uh, these adapters. They are a bit difficult to come by. RRP is about 500 quid for each of these. Um, I'm quite privileged to have both, actually. So if you need any more information or dimensions, things measuring up, then leave a comment below. I'll be happy to get back to you. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.